Hey guys, I'm going to show you our fire safety project that we did. We went and visited a fire station today and this was our project. Well, one of them. You just take a styrofoam cup and I set it out last night. I flipped them upside down. I put two beady eyes in it and the markers I wanted to use. And then we had glue sticks, obviously, and they just put polka dots all over it. And then you just need black construction paper. I let my older kids use Sharpies and my three-year-old use Crayola. And um, yeah, this was my three-year-old. I had to obviously do a lot of help on that. She did this <laughs> and uh, helped glue. And then this was my nine-year-old. She gave him a collar. Isn't that cute? And then this was my seven-year-old. She has legs on him. He's, what is he, standing? Sitting? sitting. She showed him sitting. So. Yeah, they can get as creative as they want. We thought that was so cute. And we once went and visited a firehouse today. His and name is uh, Dottie. Oh, his name is Dottie. And then this has my beady eyes in it and random erasers. So, yeah, those are obviously fun things to put together. And now they are going to get paper and make a big F and cut it out, which will be good for fine motor skills. And then they're going to glue red and yellow paper on it for fire. And then our experiment is just a cup, obviously. Well, I guess you could use a styrofoam cup, but we're going to, you get red and yellow and orange, red, orange, yellow, whatever color you want, tissue paper, and you put that in there. And then I found this on Pinterest. And then you take baking soda and you put sprinkle that in there, let them do it or dump it in a spoon. And then you can take a squirt bottle of vinegar and then you squirt it and it just eats the fire. The red paper and I you use tissue paper for that so we are super excited to do that next thanks for watching